guys you are welcome back once again to my channel <laughs> you already know anytime you see tracy cook you know that yes tracy wants to satisfy her cravings okay so on today's video i'm gonna be making ayamashe is it ayamashe i'll be ayamashe anyhow sha. i'm going to be making ayamashe sauce so i woke up this morning and that was what i was craving being that the ingredients you don't need too much to make ayamashe sauce so i'm going to be bringing my craving to reality okay so for this um dish we need green bell peppers onion atarodo pepper and guess what i have my chicken laps cut and cleaned into pieces so later i'm gonna be spicing all that up and this time around i'm not going to be frying i'm not, I'm not going to be using a fryer i will roast it in the oven okay so later i'm going to show you guys how i'm going to achieve that and today i'm going to be making more sauce so yeah this is my already cut and washed green uh, bell peppers okay so it was like this before i bought a couple like five or six okay so they're already washed and cleaned but for the purpose of this video i just want to show you guys the whole one and then show you how i wash it and already cut it later i'm gonna put it up in the blender and blend so pretty much that's all we're going to be needing for this recipe so guys right here i have my my egg later i'm gonna boil this egg and put it inside this stew hey god <laughs> what is ayama say without boiled egg inside anyway um right here i have my crayfish as well i'm gonna blend that and use it and to spice my chicken hmm i've got garlic i've got um uh, paprika that's your pepperoncino di cayena i've got my zenzero my ginger i've got the curry i've got my thyme and i've got my dried pepper okay so all this to like to spice the chicken okay so and i've got my palm oil so this palm oil i'm gonna bleach it to make this sauce okay so stick with me hey why i achieve this goodness <laughs> so guys right now what i'm gonna do is mix all my seasoning together so i have my curry my ginger my dried pepper paprika and garlic i'm just gonna mix them all together because i'll be needing this to season my chicken okay so when it's all mixed together i'm going to add it to the chicken and then mix everything together like mix it with my hands okay So right now i'm gonna assemble the already mixed chicken to my oven grill as you can see is oh my goodness this is so yummy and it looks so good <laughs> so guys as you can see i didn't add water all i did was uh, use the already blended mix to blend the remaining pepper because you know that green pepper has water so um you don't want too much water later all right so now i'm gonna clean up my boiled eggs because i'll be needing that later so now let's get to cooking right now i have my pot on the fire i'm going to add my palm oil remember i said we are bleaching so be very careful if you don't know how to bleach if you've never bleached palm oil in your life please don't try it ah as you can see my chicken oh my god juicy so later i'm going to add you see those juice falling down from the chicken the oil and everything then i'm going to add that juice to i'm going to add the juice to the sauce okay just to give you that mm. Oh my god i'm a foodie let me just stop talking so guys after allowing the 
bleached or oh, yeah cool down because you trust me you don't want to burn down your house so i took the oil outside and allowed it cool down for a bit and i'm gonna put it on the fire <coughs> and then start the cooking of this sauce okay so my eggs are ready and this is my ground crayfish okay so right now after heating my oil my onions my chopped onion is gonna go in okay afterwards i'm gonna stir and then make sure everything is good and then i'm going to add my pepper okay guys when it's dark like this you know that our ayamashi sauce is ready <laughs> ah oh my god i can't wait to taste this egg try Timo. and for my chicken my chicken is ready as well so I'm gonna put some inside the sauce and leave some out. My goodness, it's so spicy, yummy, and delicious. And voila! So, guys, my Ayama say sauce is ready. Oh my goodness, look at that egg chai! So, when the bell pepper is black like this, you know that it's really cooked and it's ready for consumption thank you so much for watching and do have an amazing amazing day bye